The fifth song on the Pink Slip EP is a song called He Loved Her. And uh, this one's really close to my heart. It's, it's, it's probably the most simple, you know, kind of down the center, for lack of a better term, easy, you know, country song that I've ever written or recorded. I wrote it with Jordan Reynolds and Nicole Galleon, both amazing people and hit songwriters in their own right. And I remember it was such an interesting day because um, we sat down and I brought up this idea of wanting to write a song, not necessarily called Tombstone, but um, what I would want to write on my tombstone. And uh, if a lot of my co-writers can tell you, but I tend to go really dark and really emotional um, with the songs I like to write, and you guys know that too by now, um, if you're watching this probably. But for this day, they kind of laughed and they were like, well, I like that idea, but maybe we bring it a little bit lighter. Um, and we try to find a way to explain it uh, in, in a more palatable way, I guess, um, than literally writing about your tombstone. And um, they, they kind of challenged me to, they were like, if you had three words, if you only had three, three words to write on your tombstone, what would they be? And I don't know why, but the first thing that popped into my head was he loved her. And so we started writing this idea. Um, and we, I think we wrote like half the song and then completely started over because it wasn't quite right yet. Like we had written like kind of a story about this guy who loves his wife and he'd paint the house and she'd say it's not the right shade and so he'd go paint it again and even though she kind of overcooked the eggs in the morning he would always eat them and it was this really sweet song but it didn't quite capture the idea, uh, uh, the bigger idea, you know, of, of a lifetime and what you would want to be known for. And so. I just started thinking about my dad and my grandpa and the kind of man I wanted to be and the kind of man I want to be known for and you know just the idea of sometimes leaving behind a legacy is a lot simpler um, than some people make it out to be like it doesn't have to be fortune and fame and acclaim um, sometimes it can be something as simple as just loving somebody being known for loving somebody um, and so I'm, I'm really proud of this song and um, in the way that we set it out so simply, uh, but hopefully pretty powerful, and I hope it means something to you guys too.